Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to another episode of the Venom Vlog, and we are back here playing Midnight Suns, and the reason for me doing this as the Venom Vlog episode is because we have just completed, mostly, the DLC, all four of them. We had Deadpool, we had uh, Storm, which came out, she came out recently, Morbius, and Venom. But now, from what I understand, there is going to be a secret mission that unlocks, and we're going to work our way to unlocking that or getting that mission. Uh, where it wraps up the storyline of Dracula, Sin, the vampires, it wraps everything up. And obviously, I'm gonna we're gonna fight that final battle with Venom on the team as long as they allow us to. So, um, so if they don't, I'm gonna scrap all this footage. <laughs> A word. Oh, here we go. So Storm already wants to talk. So let's uh, let's check our super links. Spidey had some some stuff to say. Oh, and then Eddie. Eddie would like to hang out, so Hunter, it was good to hang out. You know we're always down for a meal. Feel like coming along? Bang. You know, some Let's days start this I off a pull with a chat with Eddie. Something far off is calling and Lord Pickles in the home. chat. What up, Lord Pickles? Thanks for being here. Appreciate that. Uh, you know, some days I feel a pull like something far off is calling my symbiote home. That would be a challenging journey. Um, Space is enormous. How would you make a trip Interesting. like that? Eddie's referencing Good question. I don't know. a beacon or something, Most you know, to, to bring him back. And hope, hold on, let me turn the volume back. I think you're you probably you getting a little bit of an echo about there. Your symbiote's life before you bonded. I don't have to wonder. Here we go. I catch probably the better. Sorry if there was a little bit of a read from my other. Only the dialogue from the TV. I had the TV up really loud. Whole story. I only hear out of one ear, so it's. I see it bonding with a genetically modified Kree soldier who fought in an intergalactic war. I usually watch everything with subtitles. In another, I feel its blood. Whoa, modified Kree soldier stands over the icy graves of fallen foes. Whoa, check all this lore out. Memories of when it bonded with Spider-Man. He's talking about the shared memories. Yes, I prefer not to think of those. That's amazing. Yeah, that's one of my favorite things about the symbiote is that it can transfer memories. I do. Why do you hate him so much? It's a long story. Oh, uh, this is great. Yeah. I can make it through Doctor Strange's astral explanations. <laughs> Test me. Yeah, hit us. Honestly, I'd rather listen to Doctor Strange talk about the smell of the astral plane than dig into my history with Parker. Uh, Lord Pickle you says, just how stalling. cool the name is Aurora Monroe. Remember how I amazing. said I lost it's my journalist job character. because of some embarrassing Santa reporting? Purse. That was partly Spider-Man's fault. Spider-Man got you fired? No, he caught the Here bad guy like he always does. He just exposed the flaws in my reporting when he did it. Yeah, so how's that Spider-Man's fault? But if Spider-Man did nothing wrong, why do you hate him? Yeah. He ruined my life. He stopped the bad guy. My other. You can't argue with emotions. See, I think the symbiote has kind of twisted. The symbiote feeds off my hormones. Eddie's emotions a little bit, but then again, I think bonded, Eddie also has a, can suck their host a struggle dry. on his emotions. Are you saying your shared hatred of Spider-Man helped you and your projected hatred bond? for Spider-Man? Much like the symbiote. You owe him your life. Which makes them perfect. In no way. <laughs> But you and Spider-Man get along now. Uh, sure. If by get along, you mean my other and I agreed not to eat his pancreas. <laughs> that sounds like true friendship. <laughs> <laughs> sure, but it's nothing like the one you and I have. Your pancreas is safe from us. Thanks. Also, don't eat our lungs. <laughs> Look at that. We got Venom up to a level four friendship. We are besties. We are Venom 2, rare passive. Added an eight team friendship level. Very cool. Dahlia left this morning for Xavier School. Okay, so that wraps surprised. up. If you haven't watched the other episodes, the people who are here now, to consider. we um, so we saved the Morlocks from the vampires that were attacking, and one uh, mutant in particular named Dahlia well? was someone yes. that Storm Magic took a personal interest in because they're the both. Grew up orphans, the and uh, and Storm was trying to get her to join I'm the sure X-Men. So it looks like she they were able to join got Dahlia to at least go visit the mansion. Idea. She proposed the X-Men and the Morlocks. And that is what I was wondering. I was like, but she can't leave the Morlocks behind. She's very dedicated to them, and there you go. 
they're going to actually share space at the mansion, which is cool. I always, the Morlock thing, I always felt like, you, you know, like Nightcrawler, I think was a good representative of like, look, not everyone in the X-Men is like, a, you know, a quote unquote stereotype, like what people call normal looking. Um, it's not all supermodels at the X-Mansion, even though everyone there is in great shape <laughs> and, and look awesome and they're hot. <laughs> but, uh, but that, you know, that comes from, I guess, working out and training every day, fighting Sentinels. Um, but, uh, but yeah, some of them, their mutations are internal and not external. And so, uh, so I always liked the concept of the Morlocks and I always thought characters like Nightcrawler is like a good conduit of, you know, maybe getting the two sides to work together. Um. But Storm was also a good... I mean, she was in the comics kind of uh, part of that story, too. All right, let's see. Um, what a great idea. That is a great idea. She wants to end the confusion and stigma each group has toward the other. Oh, well, trial and error, eh? Yeah, pretty much. I'm so <laughs> proud of her. So what are your plans? I love the shirt. As if you, if no one gets that reference, uh, old lace is, only right is a uh, a dinosaur that um, one of the members the of the Runaways can communicate with. Over. Um, and it's named after the movie. I think uh, the old story, Arsenic and Old Lace. So um, so yeah. I, when I saw that shirt available, I was like, I have to have that shirt. That's a cool little deep cut reference to Runaways, which is a great. Um, one. This is the Whisper network whisper web that we created for um eddie but peter comes and hangs out with them sometimes so sometimes you'll see them over here just kind of goofing around uh there's journals that pop up in here like this one that are new that you can read and they give you arcane knowledge and they'll also give you some more lore and i will say this game the one thing i really loved is they really dove into the lore of marvel comics like the supernatural stuff you know which is among my favorite at marvel um, I, I love X-Men, I love Spider-Man and Venom, and I love those characters. But when you get into the like the stories of, uh, and obviously Moon Knight's a recent, um, I converted to being a bigger fan of Moon Knight thanks to the TV show. Um, the like the supernatural side of Marvel, I always found just the most interesting. Um, I just think there's so many cool stories and villains that aren't like household names that I feel like should be. Um, and I love characters like Blade and Ghost Rider and, you know, um, Elsa Bloodstone. Like, they're all great characters. And uh, I'm glad Marvel's starting to do more with them in the cinematic universe. Like Werewolf by Night, I thought was amazing. So here we go. Tutorial, final chapter, new story unlocked. A new story mission is now available on the mirror table. This mission to end the vampire threat once and for all may be taken at any time so that's what we're gonna go do where is it at though tomb of dracula oh what a great name that's amazing okay and it doesn't look like it's required of who i bring on the on the mission with us so oh it's bringing all of them all the dlc characters that's amazing so this is perfect we're gonna get closure for blade morbius deadpool and venom and storm um and then, obviously, the hunter so are heading to Dracula's base. Enough is enough. We must destroy Dracula. Cut off the head, and the new breed vampires will fall. We don't even know where to find him. Well, we don't not know where to find him. I'm sorry, what are you saying? Honestly, I have no idea. I stopped reading scripts in 2016. <laughs> I keep ad-lipping, no matter how many people Look tell at me, Blady so up, pissed off. Dracula, shut up. Exactly! Like that! <coughs> but no, I myself have no clue where the Big D and his army Big D. Foo Fangers might be. <laughs> but one of your guys might. Depends. You hiring? You? How? Doc Morbius said hemolisks give off a faint gamma signature, so I cross reference central satellite Look data at to find Look at the case. Then, figured Sin never flies commercial. She thinks she's too good for it, right? So I checked shield data on private flights with suspected Hydra connections around Look at the time Eddie she first showed up it. in New York. Then, traced back to the point of origin. Oh, and that sunlight serum is basically magic in a bottle. I had a hunch the mirror table could pick up vats of the stuff. If they shipped it anywhere, 
Why not home base? When you put those locations together and see where they all overlap... Voila. Dracula. And Sin, I'm guessing. Look at that, dude! You're a journalist, right? By the goddess. What are we waiting for? I love this. What a team. Look at these guys. Venom, Deadpool, Storm, Morbius, and Blade. <laughs> and Eddie, using his Whisper Network, cracked the case and figured out where the most likely place uh, Dracula and Sin are. That is amazing. Totally glad I did this now. So we got Squad 1 here. Uh, Deadpool, Morbius, and Blade. And then Squad 2. Oh, that's so cool. I'm glad they're putting uh, Venom and Storm on the same team. And Blade. I love this Blade costume. I know it's not like his his classic one, but it's one based off some of the recent Avengers comics, which I haven't liked those recent Avengers comics, but I do like the, the suit. I like the costume a lot. It's very tactical, which is Blade in a nutshell. What do vampires think when they see Venom? <laughs> like... Dude, we found his castle! Oh, that's awesome. Dude, this is wonderful. I love this. Storm, what's the forecast? Clear skies ahead. Nice. See, we, we fought... La the last mission with Storm was in the sewers with the Morlocks, and she could only use half her power because she wasn't outside. So this... Oh my god, look at that. Those bashes exploding. Oh, dude. I'm in love with this. This is so cool. To bring other Marvel characters into the supernatural side of Marvel is... is I love the contrast. It's so cool. anything behind us. But the vampires are not ready for someone like Storm. Oh, there we go, Venom. Yes! Yes! Deadpool, Morbius, <laughs> anything comes across that bridge. We Less talky, more shooty, right, Doc? That's so great. Time to make a few house calls. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Morbius had a cheesy movie line, and Deadpool was all about it. That's so great. Wow, that's a serious castle. Funny how Morbius no one has hunger his meter to track his vampiric urges. After three Morbius cards are played, he will draw the bloodlust ability. While Morbius' bloodlust, all of his damage abilities and counter attacks will apply bleeding. Ooh, I like that. A point well taken, Blade. So this is a free card, so let's go ahead and use it. Venom been working out, dude. He, oh, big time. He juicing, too. Look at that mag dump. That's awesome. Um, okay. Let's see what we got here. Boom. All right. We'll put him out. So free it. I love you, you man, but don't, don't come right up to me and do that. All right. I've been waiting. Hit him, Dr. Morbius. Let's go kill Dr. Acula. <laughs> yeah. Bless you, Ace. Can we charm her? Does that work? Yeah, no yeah. To blame but Let's charm Sin. That's awesome that we could do that. Uh, I knew her. Wait. Okay. Good. You I thought she attacked uh, Deadpool. I was like, no. All right. So now he's on bloodlust. Um. It's 
a free card too. Oh, awesome. Good. I was like, oh, I don't want to use that up if it's going to take away one of my attacks. I was, I knew that. I was like, Man, Ace is on one tonight. See, that barely even hurts her. Like, I don't know. That's not worth it. Let's do... Can't do knockback on it, but we can damage it. Nice. I think you got him. And then we can do this. So if it does spit out more vampires, it'll explode now. Because we've done so much damage to it. Um, that it'll explode. So, Alright, and now we only have Sin to deal with. I like... Like, I've gotten a little bit better doing, you know, coming up with better strategies in this game. Um, before, I was just kind of like, ah, just attack and, you know, try out the cards, see what they look like, see what the animations look like. And look at that. Boom. It had bleed on it, so it is gone. Without even pumping out more vampires. Um, and I've, I've kind of liked that. Uh, and I could never that I've had, uh, I've gotten a Dracula's little bit better Dead and smarter Man. about my strategies. Little old me storming Dracula's castle with the daywalker and the living vampire? Ah, what a crossover! <laughs> I'm glad someone is having a good time. I had to, I just did it because I wanted to see him do the rainbow thing. <laughs> That's literally the only reason I did that. <laughs> This is that card we upgraded before the battle, and I'm so glad we did. And I thought man thing was ugly. <laughs> All right, so um, yeah, relentless. Let's. There we go. Don't move too far, because I want I want to blow that thing up like next to us. Reputation. That. Get blade out of the way. Explode that. And then now I can use blade to push her back into the wall and kill her again. Boom. She done. Dude, she didn't stand a chance. Dude. Weak sauce, Sin. I expected more of you since you were such a pain in the butt to kill this whole time. Uh, she became the mist. Oh, please. Because this is not a team of superheroes, so she needs to die. <laughs> Her and Dracula need to be full-on killed. Because how stupid are they to try to build a vampire army of immortals that can walk in the sun? Oh, yes. Get her blade. Oh, Storm. Yeah, you had to have Storm get the killing blow on her, I guess, a little bit. Um, And I know Storm is, like, I said there's no heroes, and, and Storm is one, but... I feel like she'll full on kill Sin if she has to. Yeah, do it. Don't let her turn to mist. Awesome. Oh, I gotta look away from the screen. That fucking up. Okay. Boom. Was that your full power? And then some. Nice. Hey, Venom. Venom and Storm with me. Morbius, Deadpool. Can you buy us some time? Time for what? Let me guess. Tombside chat with Vladdy the Vamp Daddy? <laughs> More of a pointed discussion. Yeah, Blade's got to get the kill shot on this one. Awesome. Big is this church? Oh, Eddie, bringing Eddie back in here though was great. Bringing him to a, a church setting type thing. Oh my goodness. Not even open casket. That's right, buddy. We'll put you back in there.
Yeah, but how stupid are they? They wanted to build this army in the middle of Lilith trying to take over. Come on. The ego. I, I, I guess there was Once a point again, where Dracula said, don't worry, we'll build my army and then we'll kill Lilith. It's like, your power. dude, you ain't, you're Dracula, man. You ain't gonna kill Lilith. You're powerful, but I don't know about Lilith powerful. As you underestimate my Nah, you're a chump, dude. I'm gonna put a stake right through you. Defeat Dracula, complete a mission tip. Pikachu and attack Dracula with bleeding heroes as he has a high chance to counter. Oh, right, okay, I remember that. that you must crap see it by had. now, Dracula. Your game is coming to an end. This time, you will be our toy. Good. You're feeling confident. I don't want any excuses when you lay vanquished at my feet. Keep talking. I'm gonna enjoy this. Kill a couple vamps. Strike Big Daddy there. Big D, as Deadpool likes to call him. Um. That looks good, because I definitely don't want more and more vampires to keep popping up, so let's, let's push him into that. I don't, we're never gonna, I mean, it's, we're gonna get outnumbered here really quick. Because there was three incubating places, or four. And then, and vampires, and Dracula, like, we're gonna get overwhelmed here. Um, big time. Oh, no, we get one more, okay. Just a taste of my power. So does that mean you'd have to play the DLC over again? How'd you pro how'd you progress? No, it, I would just have to go back to the main menu, and I could go do a couple side missions and level up, and then I'd come back and do this. But we'd have to refight the sin battle, I think. So it's not the end of the world. Um, I'm just being stubborn tonight, seeing if we can. Just be a little crazy and power through it. Um, okay, so. Okay. I was hoping that was weaker than it was. It is not, so that sucks. Um, kill him at least. And then I can blow that thing up. This so at least we killed for. one pod and weakened the other two. And so far, at least, we haven't taken a shit ton of damage from Dracula. But that doesn't mean anything. He's gonna... He's coming for us. And when we got bleed on, it makes it worse. Especially on my two heaviest hitters. Okay, that's good news. Hey, we've all been there. We're gamers. Oh, yeah, I know. It's it's just one of those we were so close at one time that it, it's a, it does... Uh, it is our hunger is our strength. We will not suffer your bloodlust again. Your appetites are your own. Beast. I simply gave you a reason to indulge them. And now, we will satisfy them with your flesh. I know I've been ignoring the other th other things, but I'm so happy to see him at such low life that I'm risking it. Generous. Oh, what? He's got frenzy. You really okay. shouldn't have. Yeah, they're super vampires. That makes sense. Damn it! Not enough to kill him. 
Can we... Please give me something that can kill him. Yes. Alright, so we got him down once. So that's good. That means he, he was about to attack us all again. So that was a good time to, to take him down. And it gives us one more round before he attacks again. So we could... We can maybe take some of those vampires out. Um... We'll have to do it on the next next round because. Wait. Damn it! Nobody's. Ugh, I really hate when I don't have any characters like lined up. Because we could have kicked that bench into like three of these guys if we had someone standing right here. So that's fine. We'll just end the turn. Damn it! Dracula's gonna get back up. Oh my God! Blade's almost dead. Uh, almost is it? Nope, he's dead. Wow, they really went for Blade. Who is our healer? The damage you inflicted upon Dahlia will take years to repair, but at least she'll know her tormentor is no more. The girl should feel lucky to have served a higher purpose with her life. Her pain had meaning. I can't get enough people with that attack to make it worth it. Let's bring Blade back. That's the smarter move, I think. Back in the game. Son of a frenzy. We will get you for that. We need this right now before Dracula attacks. You have our thanks. Does Storm have bleed? Doesn't look like it. Yes. I'll remember your face. You should. Because you've killed it five times. <laughs> Alright. Damn it, these guys getting frenzy is not fun. I will make you regret that. She dead? Okay, thank you. Just this won't end well. Dude, he's doing like two of his most powerful attacks. Okay. Oh, Venom. Come on, baby. Stay with me. Stay with me. Okay, he's dead. He was going to be my next, uh, next major move, but... I'm going to do this instead. I will show you true power. I think you got him. Don't attack, don't retaliate, don't retaliate, don't retaliate. Don't retaliate, don't retaliate. Let me live, let me live, let me live. your defeat. Yes! Venom, even though he was down, I was able to push Dracula right into him to get that killing blow. Screw this. I'm not missing the boss fight. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Come on, guys. Take him out. Oh! Oh my god! Oh my god. His leg went backwards. Dude, look at Venom getting in that punch. Oh, jeez, no. 
<laughs> this is amazing. Oh man, we are losing. It's deja vu. Come on, Blade. Come on, Blade. You know what to do. This is your role, man. You were born to kill vampires. <laughs> Stab that motherfucker. <laughs> There you go. No, save Eddie, save Eddie. There you go. Teamwork. Oh. Eddie, use your symbiote. There you go. Dude, like butter. Oh, yes. Whoa. Right, you better run like a Deadpool crawling. You think you've won. Dude, Without Venom, grand bite his head off. Nothing will protect you from what is coming. Turn to ashes. Come on, die. Ah, oh, you can't leave him like that. Set his ass on fire. We'll manage. Oh, uh, did you want to get a lick in? Oh, no. You had it handled. My concern, as always, is the bigger picture. <laughs> yeah, you guys gotta go. It's for some reason an earthquake occurred. <laughs> the devil. The new breed of vampires <laughs> are no more. Look at his leg. Why? They could let us have a serious moment. <laughs> no more bad food. Maybe you like pancakes. It is past time we go. Oh. Thank thankfully that appeared out of nowhere. Never been so happy to see a shiny blue hole. Oh, except for the time I met Ronan the Accuser. It's beautiful. <laughs> Do you think he's really gone? No, he's alive I'm in there, sleeping. The <laughs> you guys didn't set him on fire and chop his head off and separate his heart. Like, you didn't do anything. <laughs> Just put a lid on him. I ain't gonna do shit. Blade 2099. He's gonna fight Dracula. He'll wake up again. Order of the Midnight Suns. Yay, we did it. Lord Pickles, thanks for hanging with me on that one. For those who are watching this later, uh, that took us five or six times. How many times did it take us to kill Dracula? Almost. It was the same the last time we fought him when we had the Morbius DLC. It took us like five or four or five times, I think, to beat him. Uh oh, post credit scene. Are you kidding me? Sin is still alive? This is why when someone just falls off a ledge, you just you don't assume they're gone. You gotta find the body. An unworthy master. Yeah. I shall not make the same oh. mistake twice. Okay. They gave her a little red skull action, like her grandfather. Okay, then. 